Now to a long-simmering civil rivalry that finally came to a tragic end this morning in Red Bank. Police tell us the brother is now dead and the sister in the hospital with self-inflicted stab wounds. News Channel 9's Betsy Golden is here now with details. Betsy. Well, police have charged 63-year-old Glenda Forrest for the first-degree murder of her brother Donald Barnes. Investigators found Barnes this morning dead in his bedroom. The first call Red Bank police got this morning about the Red Bank siblings was from their cousin. Glenda Forrest had called her cousin to confess. She let them know that she had just killed her brother and that she wanted to make sure that somebody would come and watch the dogs. It was just before 7 a.m. when police arrived at the home. They say they could hear shouts from a woman inside. They found Forrest bleeding from self-inflicted stab wounds in her stomach and her brother, Donald Barnes, dead in the bedroom. They say he had been stabbed multiple times. Forrest and her brother lived together on Lowellwater Road. Police say they had a very tumultuous relationship. We've been out there a number of times. Some of them have been on disorder. Some of them have been on domestic assaults, uh, where one has alleged domestic assault against the other. The pair kept away from neighbors, but those living close enough observed their behavior. They didn't bother anybody. They pretty much stayed with themselves. Uh, both of them uh, would drink beer, and, uh, and the, the man, he, he worked in his shop in the basement, and then in the afternoons he'd sit down and just uh, drink beer and watch the traffic go by. Forrest is now recovering in the hospital for stab wounds. She will be under guard until she is released. Then she will be booked into the Hamilton County Jail. And Forrest will be held without bond. Depend on us to keep you updated.